Hi everybody! Welcome back to the Caribbean. Mistakes have been made. I realize this. We're far, we're sailing out of Grand Bahama. We uh we have 36 crew, which is not nearly enough crew. Uh, we're a journeyman. We've increased the difficulty. We now have an arch nemesis. Uh, we're sort of messing around in and around Grand Bahama uh, because we want to get in good with the Spanish, possibly, maybe. I mean, although we're already good with the French, so maybe we can just go off and find somebody better looking than the uh, daughter of Grand Bahama. <laughs> Which, I mean, it's got to be said. She's not too bad, but at the same time. Maybe, um, maybe the one before was, oh my god, check it out, Grand Bahama might actually be changing over to Dutch rule shortly. No, it was defeated. The Dutch have been defeated in Grand Bahama. That's crazy. A prosperous Spanish village. All right, we've got to do some raiding. We need to, um, we need to bolster the coffers, uh, in a major way. We also need to get a better ship. We need more crew. I need to get better at sword fighting because I'm really bad at it right now. We're going to sail with the wind, uh, and we're also going to try to uh, offload this stupid ass... Oh, here we go. English smuggler, you're mine. Don't even think about it. We're going to get you. We're going to even possibly sink you. All right. Which ship shall we attack with our flag flagship, the San Herman Dildo? Uh, we're going to attack Betsy, who has 54 men and 6 guns. We're going to have to do some expert sailing here. Fire! We're going to whittle them down. See, he's like, he's trying to come in at me because he knows that he's got way more crew than me. So we're going to have to slow him down with the chain shot. Oh my god, it didn't work. <laughs> oh god. Alright, fine. He just seemed to have like some raging boner to fight me. So, alright, fine. I'm ducking and thrusting. I'm also jumping and thrusting. I'm ducking and I didn't quite... I'm ducking. Oh, I parried. Okay. I've knocked him down. I might win this sword fight yet. All right, ducking. It hit me. I should have probably parried. I'm going to parry. All right, he's knocked me back. We have 12 pirates left. He's got 41. We're going in for the thrust. We've regained some sort of advantage in the sword fighting stakes. That didn't work. Okay, I'm ducking. All right, that works. All right, we're going in for the thrust. We may be able to thrust here. We're going to jump. Not quite. Okay, fine. I parried, and I'm running away. I have five dudes left. All right. The advantage is ours once again. Thrust. Not quite. That's fast. Uh, we've lost. Oh, God. Okay, but that was better, though, right? That was much better. Are we going to get incarcerated? Don't incarcerate. Oh, shit. We've been incarcerated again. I can't believe it. God, I fucking suck so bad at this fucking game. I really need to rethink my strategy here in a major way. You're captured and locked away in the Nassau prison. Okay, fine. That's okay. We'll let the months pass. We're gonna be like old as hell. Uh, we're gonna break out of here, no problem. All right, fine. We're breaking out of here, no problem. We're in Nassau once again. This is our second incarceration. Even though I proclaimed at one point that we were original Gs uh, and that we were never going back into the big time ever again, here we are once again, starting an episode, breaking out of the big time. It's almost going to become like a thing. But I think my sword fighting was better that time. I think I just started shitting the bed a little bit uh, when I couldn't quite read his um, thrusts that I should have just parried uh, instead of trying to duck everything. But we'll get there. Okay, great. We're going to jump over this wall. There's my salty dogs. I don't know if this like mini game is meant to actually be difficult or if it's just supposed to like, sort of make you feel uneasy. You escape the clutches of your captors. Okay, great. We're back. Oh my god. That's Na Nassau is like a death trap. Okay, we have 40 crew. We have 19 months of food and we have 488. Okay, are, are we gonna go for a, dra a grain transport again? Because that was easy last time. Or do we just need to get more crew? All right, fine. You know what? We're gonna get out of the north. I feel like the north is bad luck for me. We're gonna get out of the north and we're gonna go back to where we started. Uh, in port of pay and all those other places and we're gonna see if maybe we can get in with the French Man, I really like actually switching allegiances like every five seconds. That is nice. Maidenhead? No. Do we want to go to Maidenhead? No, we do not. We want to- do we want to go to Mad Dick's Bones? No, we certainly do not. We want to come down here to Bienfaisant, Charlesville, maybe, Tortuga, which is quite nice actually, port of pay 
port of pay is huge. We've got Santiago down here as well. Fine. We're heading the right way. Your second lieutenant approaches you on the quarterdeck. Captain, we've been sailing over 16 months with only 488 gold pieces to show for it. Perhaps we should return to port and divide up the plunder. You want to divide that up, you son of a bitch? Okay, well, we're about to face a mutiny now. We've been sailing for a long-ass time with the same crew. Uh, and I guess that they counted my um, incarceration uh, in that time as well. All right, fine. I think we're going to have to go to a friendly Jesuit mission. And I think we're going to have to possibly trade with the abbot. Do you want to trade some stuff, abbot? Holy shit. I don't think I've ever done this before. Do you want some guns or anything? It's got a bit of food. All right, Abbott, you have nothing that we really want. We're going to sail away. All right. We have to make it to somewhere so that we can get rid of these mutinous salty dogs and maybe get some better dogs and maybe also lower the difficulty because this game is very, very hard. All right. On me, ships. Uh, on the San Herman Dildo, we're sailing against the wind, uh, which is really taking it out of us. The crew is becoming even more... Mutinous. It looks like there's going to be a showdown in the sea up there. We have another friendly Jesuit mission here, San Atticus, that we don't want to stop at because that abbot probably just has like a bunch of bum fluff to sell us that we don't want. We're going to try to make it to Tortuga if we can. Okay, we've been sailing for seven... Yes, I know, Lieutenant. I know. You talked to me about this last month and I've done my best to ignore you all for a month now. But obviously, my best ignoring tactics aren't working, and everybody's getting really, really feisty. We're just trying to get to, to Tortuga, okay? Oh, look at that. It's a French boat behind us transporting immigrants. What a shame it would be if I took all of the people from that boat and made them my new crew and got rid of these ones. All right, we're going to divide the plunder. If only the wind wasn't working against us, we could get here in some decent amount of time. All right, up prosperous French trading post. We're coming in. God, it's been a while since we've been to a French port. All right. Let's 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 immediately divide the plunder. Fine. Everybody <laughs> are 10%. This is crazy. All right. Everybody is going to take 11 gold with them and I'm going to get 48 gold. Okay. Sounds good. All right. Get out of here. Uh, revert to apprentice captain. <laughs> no, we have to. We have to stay as journeymen, okay? <laughs> we have to get better at this game. It's no good just reverting the difficulty. All right. Get out of here, you you traitorous dogs. You should have stuck with me the whole time, but no, you didn't. Okay. Trade with the merchantmen? Great. Oh, look at all this. Uh, we've got a bit of food. We could do with a little bit more. We have 100 gold. We're back to 100 gold. We're, like, starting from scratch once again. Uh, how are we looking with, uh, in terms of our boat? Okay, we still have all of our upgrades, which was just fine grain powder, okay? Perfect, the San Herman Dildo is ready to go. Let's go to the tavern. Let's see if we can recruit some dogs and also, hey, what's this? This will help win the heart of the governor's daughter and can be yours for only 1,350 gold pieces. Unfortunately, you only have... Okay, fine. Well, I'll be back for that ring. I would love to win the heart of a daughter. 22 men offer to join the current crew. Welcome aboard, mates. Great. All right. We might stand a chance out there. What about you? It's pretty quiet around here, sweetie. Okay, thanks for letting me know. And the shipwright in Port of Pay can upgrade your ship with iron scantlings if you like. Your ship will resist damage. That sounds great. All right. So are we back in with the French? Let's talk to the governor of this place and see what he has to say. My dear Colonel Landon, please come in. I understand that you've been incarcerated once again by the English and you're some sort of tremendous failure. Um, I'm going to actually demote you to the rank of potato peeler. We are at war with the evil Spanish and the perfidious English. Oh. Well, that was unexpected. <laughs> okay, thank you. I'm also pleased to grant you an estate of 150 acres on the outskirts of town. Great, okay. Tortuga, I see by the scar on your cheek that you have been wounded in battle. Perhaps a brief session with my fencing master will sharpen your skills? No, it is but a scratch. Wow, wow, wee wow, look at her. You are quite a handsome young ruffian. Perhaps when you have achieved the rank of baron, you could escort me to the grand ball. All right, I will work on that. The king has ordered me to dispatch an offer of peace to the English city of Port Royal. The offer will be carried by the royal sloop Junon. Please ensure that this vessel arrives safely at its destination. I will escort it personally. As an admiral, I would love to. Au revoir, you two. I'll be back. Oh my god, this is going to be fantastic. Okay, let's trade with the merchant. 
We're gonna need some food. We're gonna blow all of our money on food uh, so that we can uh, actually survive this mission. Delivering the peace treaty. All right. Uh, the peace treaty is in the wackiest boat I've ever seen in my entire life. All right, where are we going? We're going to Port Royale. I hope that's not north um, because actually I've had some, I've had some really, really, is it, is it north? Oops, I can't quite, there we go. I have to be very delicate. <laughs> Where's Port Royale? Is it up here somewhere? Where the shit? Anyone? God, I've been incarcerated so many times. Port Royale is down here. Okay, great. It's not north. It is indeed to the southwest. We're going to have to go past Santiago and past San Abraham and Louisville. All right, fine. Down we go. Come with me. We're going to Port Royale. Can we go through here? Yes, this is the right way. Perfect. What is this boat doing? It's Why is it just swooping around like that? I could use that boat, actually. Or is it the same boat as I already have? I think it's the same boat that I already have. All right. So we're pirates, and we're delivering a peace treaty to Port Royale. Hopefully nothing goes wrong. Uh, okay, fine. We're here. Oops. Whoops. Okay. We're on the right track. We're heading down here. There's Santiago. Okay. I just had to get my bearings. I had to, like, look at the sun and put, like, a stake in the middle of the boat. to, And by that, I mean, like, a sizzling, you know, um, rib ribeye steak. <laughs> No, I meant like a, a post in the stake uh, in the in the boat so that I could see what time it was because of course there's no clocks in this day and age. There we go. Port Royale. What time is it? What day is it? Who cares? We're delivering a peace treaty to Port Royale and we also have uh, Blackbeard in our sights and the pod of dolphins is now following our convoy. All right. Well, that was fairly straightforward actually. No problems. Oh, what ship shall we attack with our... What? We don't want to attack that. <laughs> Why would we attack that? We've just done our best to actually escort it to a prosperous English trading post called Port Royale. God, there is nothing down here, is there? All right, in you go. Come on. How do I get my um, my upgrade now? There, the French King's Peace pro proposal has been accepted. England and... Wow. All right, so the English and the French are now peaceful with each other, which means that we can go and just seriously uh, duke it out with the Dutch now if we want to. Alright, fine. That's good news. Port Royale. Uh, we could have stopped uh, but I have no money so there would have been pointless stopping. We're going to head back this away and we're going to see if we can find some Dutch to tangle with or maybe even some Spanish even though that's... We have 62 crew. There's probably no chance in hell that we can take down any of these. What's this? Is that a trade? It is. It's a trade boat. Alright, here we go. Spanish trade galleon Novi Novia de Ruborazion, I think. 38 men, 10 guns. It's a big old boat. We're going in for it. Oh my god, it's open fire on us straight away. Okay, fine. We're also going to open fire. We have long range shots. Here we go. We have unleashed a terrible volley and... Oh my god, it's a direct hit. Alright, we're going to wait for the reload and... Once again, another terrible volley. There we go. Four guns, 30 crew. We're whittling them down. We're duking it out on the high seas. Oh, this is the way to do it. Look at that. Pretty soon they're going to have no guns. We've just completely shot up all their guns. They have 28 crew. They're going to surrender like straight away. Let's do some more damage to it. This is a huge one. Actually, I think we're going to be rich as hell after this one. We're going to knock all their barrels and their crew off. Look, they're coming in for a ram. I don't think so, Spanish trade galleon. There we go. We didn't even need to sword fight that time. Thank God. As your ship approaches, the enemy strikes your colors. A pretty pile of golden plunder are yours for the taking. Wonderful. Your courage has impressed the enemy. An eager group of 13 sailors volunteer to join your crew of 62. Welcome aboard, you traitors. Holy shit, 793 gold pieces plundered. We're going to take everything. We're going to tow this thing with us as well. We're going to keep her. Uh, and then we're going to sell her, uh, even though she's been damaged to hell. And uh, we're also going to sell... Wow, 66 tons of goods. Holy shit. All right, there we go. My god. Uh, we're going to get a total... We're going to be a baron off the back of this. For sure. I think that Spanish ship is trying to come after me now. If this is another trade one, we're going for it. Oh, it is too. Look at that. Six weeks. They're, they're bound for Grand Bahama. All right, great. It's attrition, Grand Bahama. We're coming in. <laughs> we don't want any deliveries reaching Grand Bahama. We're done with Grand Bahama. There we go. Stay clear, you scurvy pirate. 
I don't think so. The Galicia, 10 guns and 65 men. We have 48 men and 12 guns. I think we can do it. I think we're going to whittle them down big time again. We're going to make them beach. Oh, look at that. They're barely even fighting back. What a bunch of babbies. Come on, you babbies. He's stuck on the beach. How can you believe this? He's only got seven guns now. Oh, shit. He's not afraid to use them, though. All right. We're going to turn around again. We're going to get the wind with us this time. He's down to four guns and 55 dudes. Fine. All right. Let's change to chain shot so that he can't actually get away. All right. Here. Chain shot. Here we go. Oh, shit. We're getting, like, pretty close to the old, um... Oh, is it a Jesuit mission? Ah, who cares? It's a Jesuit mission. We'll be fine. All right. We want round shot again, and we're going to try to take out the rest of his guns if we can. Is he going to sail directly through the Jesuit mission? All right. He's still got 54 crew, and it looks like he's seeking refuge inside the Jesuit mission. The San Herman Dildo is relentlessly firing round shots. We still have 10 guns. We're going for a full reload. Uh, we want... We, Ideally, I think we want to actually board this thing and take them out, but I think we'll whittle it down a little bit more. We have to be careful. We don't want to sink it. We want to take it over. Okay, 45 crew, no guns. These guys don't stand a chance, right? We're going to have a sword fight probably, though. All right, here we go. We're going to weave in. No! No sword fight required. Another trade galleon down. As your ship approaches, the enemy strikes a color, a pretty pile of golden plunder, yours to the taking. Wonderful! Oh, your courage has impressed the enemy. An eager group of seven sailors want to join. Great. Welcome aboard. Holy shit. 705 gold pieces plundered. Look at all of the goods. Oh my god, we have 128 tons of goods now. All going to Grand Bahamas. No longer. All right, fine. I, I hope we're still at war with the Spanish as, as French pirates. That would be great. There's a French smuggler coming in. Hey, smuggler, you're doing it wrong. Look at this. I got two trade galleons behind me. I've taken them both over with my little ass ship. What do you think of that? You're doing it all wrong. Dump your potatoes. Go for the big ones <laughs> like I've done. God, we've actually got some money for once. Oh, shit. What is this? They're going to Santiago. Is it? Okay, don't worry. I am a scurvy pirate, but I won't. I don't want to tussle. I just want to get in here and I want to trade with the merchant. I want to get rid of my goods. Oh, look at this. For eight gold, we can sell, like, tons of goods. We're going to have so much money. It's going to be fucking crazy. Excellent. Okay, we're going to wipe them out totally. Oh, my God. It's taking forever to wipe them out totally. Can I just hold it down? Oh, you can. Look, it goes, like, much faster. Whoa! All the goods are gone. I could have just sold all because we have nothing else. They have no guns to sell or anything. They got a bit of sugar. Fine. Okay, great. We're going to take... Uh, let's get some more food. We'll get like 45 tons of food. Perfect. Let's go to the shipwright. Uh, we don't want to have these stupid-ass ships tailing along with us, but we do want to repair the San Herman dildo for sure. We also want to upgrade the triple hammocks. Hell yeah. That is nice. Okay. The uh, Novia du Ruborabizgorbriogian we can sell. And we can also sell the Galicia because we don't need these. Are you sure you want to sell this ship and dump 15 tons of cargo? Yeah, okay, fine. Perfect! We have some gold! 2,450 gold pieces to be exact. This is great! Okay, let's go to the tavern and see if we can recruit some more salty dogs. There's 16 of them that want to join us, and they'll uh, benefit greatly from the triple hammocks that we just installed on the San Herman dildo. Come aboard, mates! Great! A mysterious traveler offers to share you with you some Information from his recent visit to Maracaibo. Sure, tell me more. Maracaibo is a prosperous Spanish trading post. Hmm, maybe we'll have to attack it. Thank you. What about you? It's rumored that the Spanish treasure fleet is headed for Rio de la Hacha with a fortune in gold bouillon. Okay, I'll note that. Thank you. And the shipwright in Porta Pay can upgrade. Yeah, okay, fine. We're in Tortuga. I forgot. This guy just says the same goddamn thing every time. Perfect. All right, Governor, what do you think? Yeah? My dear go? Admiral Landon, please come in. This is it. We're going to be barren. As you know, we are at war with the evil fall. Spanish. Bring I understand that thing. recently you captured a Spanish trade galley and you delivered a peace treaty to the English. Excellent. The king will be pleased. Soon you will be promoted to baron. Au revoir. What do I have to fucking do to become a French baron? I mean, a couple of acres. I, I did a lot out there, governor. Jesus Christ. 
All right, well, fine. I think we have just enough time to go and lay the smack down on another Spanish boat or Dutch if we see it. Uh, and that should hopefully get us our Baron ship, I hope. There's some pirate raiders. Pirate raiders? Yes. The pirate brigantine Marianne. I want this. They have 98 men. I want this boat. We are going to have this boat. Okay. Do not just board me, you bastards. All right. We're going to go chain shot. We're going to slow them down so they don't just board me. And then we're just going to hammer them. And we're going to steal their stupid ass boat. It's going to be fantastic. Did we hit it? Slow down. No. No. <laughs> I can't. All right, I think we can go a little bit faster than them. Please, no. I don't want to be boarded by 123 men. I only have 98. Well, that's actually not too bad. The sword fighting, oh god, it's pirate raiders. All right, we're gonna go for the rapier. We're gonna try our best here. We're going to duck. Okay, perfect. We are going to duck. And perfect, and we are going to jump. We didn't quite jump. We're going to jump. Oh, that was the sweep, okay. We're going to duck. We should have parried. We're going to parry. That was a taunt. We're going to parry. Not quite. Okay, and that was the sweep. I should have jumped. Oh, God. Okay, we're going to... Oh, God, I should have parried. I should be parrying. Oh, God. We're really getting hammered here. It's hard. It's so hard. Why? <laughs> Why every time? All right, I'm just going in for the thrust. For fuck's sakes. We're just gonna we're just gonna cheese it big time. Here we go. We're not losing to these pirates. No way, no how. 76 buccaneers, 58 pirates. We got this. All right, fine. Here we go. Full thrust all the time, Alandon. That's right. They call him the thrust master of the seven seas, and he's gonna live up to his repute. Shit. It landed. All right. Should we try to read this one? We're gonna jump. Jump. We're gonna parry. Thrust. We're gonna jump. Oh my God. We did a swing move. And a thrust. We're gonna parry this one. Okay, we're gonna duck. Not quite. Thrust. We're gonna jump. Oh, we hit him as well. And a thrust. And a jump. Not quite. He hit our. Somehow managed to hit our feet. That's a sweep. Damn it. Oh god, this is a close one actually. Oh, did we manage to jump that one? Shit. Alright, that's a jump for sure. More thrusting. Oh god, the sweeps. I'm able to read the sweeps. I can't believe it. This is somehow sort of working. Parry. Not quite. Uh, Parry. Oh, he's got the advantage again. We've got him down to 26 Buccaneers, though. Oh, my God. And we're at 29. This is going to be a close one. Duck. Wonderful. Okay. <laughs> he's on the retreat. Jumping. No. Thrusting. Thrusting again. Uh, a Parry. Possibly. Oh, we hit him. Oh, we hit him. We've hit him. <laughs> Jumping. No. No. Please. He's down to 13 Buccaneers. We might get him. Oh, we got <laughs> Finally. Finally. We've won a sword fight. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. Pirate Raiders. Eat my shit. That's right. Just double it all up. 342 gold pieces. Fantastic. Look at all the food. Look at all the guns. We're going to keep this ship because we're going to make it a... It's a brig, right? It's going to be better. Oh, it's better than a sloop, I hope. The sloop John B. Great. All right, excellent. Pirate raiders have been destroyed. Our fame has increased. We have a better ship that we can trade to or change to after we, like, upgrade it and stuff. Oh my god. Okay, things are on the up. We have 63 crew left. We could do with recruiting some more. We might have to divide the plunder at some point, but they seem pretty happy for now. Holy shit. All in a day's work in the Caribbean. Am I right? We're back to Tortuga. Let's see what the governor has to say about this. My dear Admiral Landon, please come in. As we know, we're at war with the evil Spanish, I know. I understand that recently you captured a band of pirate raiders and you captured a Spanish trade galleon. Excellent. The king will be pleased soon. You will be promoted to baron, but not quite yet. Okay. We're so close to becoming barons. It's crazy. All right. Well, holy shit. That was pretty action-packed. Um, we managed to beat some raiders. Um, we're going to take that ship and use it as our flagship uh, and hopefully name it the San Hermandildo because it's a great name for a ship. Uh, we sunk... Uh, well sunk we didn't actually sink we plundered many spanish trade galleons we spent a bit of time in jail but all in all i think we're uh, doing a bit better anyway 
And as I get better at sword fighting, hopefully we'll be able to take it to the evil pirate Blackbeard uh, and gain that top spot as the most notorious pirate in all of the Caribbean. It'll be slow going, but we'll get there eventually. Excellent. All right, well, as usual, thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.